What are you doing, Gray? I'm taking the tape off. Oh, are you helping me? So last night I went and painted all of our white cabinets. They desperately needed a paint. I first oh, tried just yes, like scrubbing okay. them clean and it really didn't do much and so we just decided we just have to paint them again. When we first moved into this house five years ago, we went and painted the cabinets. They were white, but they just needed like, uh, they just needed like a touch up because they were looking dull. So after five years of use, they've gotten dull again, so I went ahead and painted them. We're just trying to get things done for whenever we do have to put our house up for sale, we're not like scrambling at the last minute. So this is something I've wanted to do for a while and finally last night I got the ambition to do it. So that's what I did last night. I haven't gotten all the cabinets though. I still need to get like this cabinet. I don't think I got like in here or in here. And then down here, like I was wanting to paint all of this too, possibly. I'm not sure. There's a cabinet there. I definitely need to get that. And then we painted the doors when we first moved in too. All of our doors were wood. Um, and even the trim, like the baseboards and all of it was wood. It was just very old looking. And so we painted everything white. And so I think it looks a lot better, but the thing with painting everything white is after time with kids and just general wear and tear, they just become dull. So I think we're gonna try and paint all the doors again, or at least like spot paint, I don't know. Um, but just trying to get little things done here and there. But today is daylight savings time. And so since it's March, and spring, we're springing forward an hour, and so technically, <laughs> according to yesterday, it's only 7.30 right now, but now that we're in daylight savings time, it is 8.30 now. So the whole day is just gonna kinda seem jumbled up. I'm not quite sure what to do with like the boys' schedule. I did end up like waking them and me up like a half hour earlier um, instead of like the full hour. So hopefully it goes okay. I always feel like the kids have a hard time adjusting to daylight savings, which I don't blame them. I have a hard time with it too. So we'll see how like nap time and bedtime goes for them. Thankfully, like they're both usually pretty good that if we put them down to bed and they're not tired, they're usually just quiet and play in their rooms until they do fall asleep. It's just harder on nap time because if Porter's not tired, he'll just sit there and cry. Grayson's better, he'll just have quiet time, but Porter hasn't quite gotten that quiet time routine down. So yeah, we'll see how it goes today, but yes, it is middle March daylight savings and we got what I'm hoping is our last bit of snow <clears throat> so yes we have snow last weekend it was like 60s or 70s and we went out and walked and went to the park and now one week later it's Sunday and it had snowed <laughs> Right now, I think they said it feels like eight degrees, but by Thursday, it's gonna feel like 70 degrees. So it's gonna be a huge um, change in weather. I always feel like I get really bad headaches when that happens with like the pressure change, but I I'm ready for the warm weather. So we are tired of the snow. No, we're not going outside, it's cold. That's the other problem, yeah. is the boys constantly yeah. Yeah. want to go yeah. outside. And we can't really do that when it's freezing cold out. So, um, starting tomorrow, it should be warmer. So we'll be able to start doing that, which it's is, warmer. which will be nice. It's warmer outside. What are you doing? It's no, no, I don't want a veggie straw. No, thank you. Go give one to Grayson. Can you go give one to Grayson? Porter is a lover and he just likes to share. <coughs> Give it to Grayson. Give it. Give a veggie straw to Gray Gray. He loves to share. Mmm. Mmm. Can you Daddy. give one to Grayson? Can you give him one? Daddy. 
Oh, very nice. Thank you. Mmm, veggie straws at 8.30 in the morning. All right. I never updated you guys on how our house hunt went. Uh, last vlog, I was telling you guys that we were going to go look at a couple houses. Um, and we actually really liked the one. And um, we've actually put an offer in on it. So we find out t tonight, I think, because all offers have to be in by like 3 p.m. today. So we put in our offer yesterday just to be done with it. And we'll see if we get in or not. This market, which I'm sure you all know, is just crazy, crazy. And so even though we went several thousand over asking price, I wonder if it still won't be enough. So anyway, yeah, that's the new thing. We actually found a house that we liked enough to put a bit on it. It's just in the city over from where we are. The schools are awesome. It's right by the zoo. So if we get it, we get it. And if we don't, then that's okay. We'll just keep looking. So we'll see how it goes. I'll definitely keep you guys updated today. Hi. You say hi. Hi. You spelled elephant? Yeah. Hi. You eating your veggie straws? Uh -oh. We gotta clean up this playroom. It's a mess. So anyway, yeah, I'll keep you guys updated on that. I'll let you know how the boys are doing with daylight savings. And also, I'm gonna go shopping with my mom and sister. We are leaving for Nashville slash my cousin's wedding Hi. this week. And so we're doing like one last shopping trip to try to find like any dresses we might want for like the wedding festivities or any shoes or anything. So hi. <laughs> you say hi. hi. So um, I'll try and vlog a little bit of us shopping. We're gonna go to the outlet mall. We've this will actually be our third time shopping. We've been to two different malls on two separate weekends in Columbus and found some things but not like everything that we were wanting to do. Mostly we're trying to find shoes. And so we're gonna go one more time shopping. Anthony is awesome and has been watching the kids for me, although I usually try to go at nap time so they're just like sleeping, but um, yeah, we're gonna go shopping one last time before we go for this wedding and stuff, so. We've got a busy week coming up, that's for sure. Also, this little boy turns 18 months old tomorrow. He's gonna be a year and a half. Porter, this is his new word. Porter, say yellow. Yellow. Wait, let Porter say. Porter, say yellow. Yellow. Yellow, that's his new word. You so smart. Yellow. Yellow. And you say blue. Mm. Blue. It's like he has this tongue and he doesn't know what to do with it. Blue. This is so cute. Happy birthday. <laughs> it's not your birthday yet, but what do you have in your hands? A card. A card. So I'm going to cover up our address. But we got Grayson's um, birthday party invitations in the mail. We're doing an ABC alphabet theme. And so I found these on Zillow. Don't mind my painted hands. I was painting the cabinets, as I said earlier. But yeah, we got these in the mail. Super cute. They're just ABC themed. So that's what we're going to do is ABCs because Grayson loves the alphabet. Don't you? Because Grayson loves the alphabet. So we are very excited, huh? For your birthday? How old are you? Are you ready, Mama? How old are you going to be on your birthday? Four. Four. Grayson Ooh. is turning four. Grayson's turning four. Yay. Also, it's been a couple hours later. I wanted to give you an update. We heard about the house that we bid on and we did not win it. Somebody bid way more than we did. So we continue the search for a house. It's totally okay that we didn't win it. We will keep looking. That's the most fun part. You know, once you win the house, then you have to actually like stage your house and pack and move. So this is the most fun. So we just keep getting to have more fun. So didn't get the house, but that's all right. We will keep looking. Um, but yeah, I just um, addressed all of Grayson's birthday party cards. His birthday party is the day before his birthday on the 10th because his birthday is on a Monday this year. So we've got less than a month to go. I've already ordered cake and cookies. I have a couple presents for Gray, but I need to get a couple more and order decorations. I am having the hardest time finding 
ABC or Alphabet or whatever, um, plates and napkins. Amazon doesn't have anything. I looked online at Party City. I guess I could go in the store and look. Cannot find ABC anything. Maybe I should try like Target or something or Meyer. I don't know. If you guys know of any places that have like ABC themed plates and napkins, let me know down below because I'm having the hardest time finding any. But we will find some. So yeah, just getting ready for Grayson's birthday in less than a month. Are you so excited for your birthday? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Go and ABC cake. Yeah, we are gonna have an ABC cake. And here's little Porter. What's up, Porter? Do you want some more water? Okay, thank you. I'm gonna get him more water. Sure. You wanna see it? <laughs> Porter is Anthony's sous chef today. They're grilling up some chicken. Frying. Oh, frying some chicken. <laughs> <laughs> he loves watching people cook. Got to wait until it's all done, bud. It's going to take at least five to ten minutes. He wants it to happen right away. No, we can't put any more in, bud. And Grayson's in here. He's on my Snapchat. He likes to snap people and talk to them on my phone. I'm in an ice cream cone. Yeah, <laughs> he's playing with filters on my phone. Oh, you're in an ice cream cone. I am back from shopping with my mom and sister and I didn't vlog at all. Just didn't think about it. We got some gifts for Grayson's birthday, some grocery items. I got more diapers for Porter. It really wasn't that exciting. We got the boys matching swimsuits for our trip to Dustin in June. Super cute, even have matching hats. So I can't wait to put them in those. But other than that. <laughs> Can you say hi? Oh. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Wow. 